Hey, what's up everyone? Shane here with ROA Off-Road. I'm over at the Utah Experience Center. Don't forget, we also have a place out in South Carolina. Today, I'm pretty excited to announce something new here at ROA. And we're always looking for something new and cool, innovative, that's just kind of in our DNA. We're never satisfied with just the status quo or always sticking with one thing. We always want to be improving and upgrading. That's what we do with all the trailers we have. And today, we're not necessarily improving or upgrading a trailer that we have, but we're adding a new trailer to our product line. And today, it is the high altitude trailer company. These guys are made in the USA out in Colorado. Super excited about this company, super excited about these trailers. I'm gonna go into a quick little walk around and just give you some of my favorite things about these trailers. Let's get into this. Okay, first and foremost, uh, these guys, we uh, synced up with them maybe a year or two ago, we started chatting with them. They were designing a new trailer and we kind of jumped into conversations with them saying, hey, we really like what you guys do and we'd like to sync up and do something with you. So our relationship isn't like brand new. We know these guys, they're incredible guys, very entrepreneurial, uh, very innovative, very visionary, but quality, quality, quality. These guys are really good at building a great trailer. And I've been talking with another dealer that carries their product also for maybe a year or two because we carry some similar things. And he just keeps on telling me, man, I love the high altitude guys. Their trailers are amazing. I almost never have problems with them. Like, and they go so good to work with. And, and then I'm like, yeah, I know, I like them too, but we've been working on a different project with them. And it just dawned on me. I was like, why are we not carrying their smaller trailers? Because they are building something for us that's really exciting. But I was like, you know, everybody raves about them. The owners do, the dealers that sell them do, and that's a big deal. And I was like, you know what? We need to sync up and start carrying your guys' smaller product line, right? Because we do have some smaller trailers and I really wanted to bring these on. Uh, they have two different models. The two main models over here we have on the right, this is the XT50. Uh, this is a, it's a teardrop style trailer, but I wanna talk a little bit about the construction in a second. But before I wanna talk, this is the PSX50. And this, as you can see, is a toy hauler. So you have a ramp for like four wheelers. This is rated for about a thousand pounds worth of cargo. So you throw up a snowmobile or a four wheeler, really cool option. The trailers themselves, what I like about them and what makes them so unique from most any teardrop on the market is the, the actual construction, the body itself. It's a composite, it's a one piece composite molded fiberglass. Uh, what that means is there are no seams in this trailer. As you can see, this is a seamless body. What does that mean? That means you're never going to have leaks in the seams right there. You'll never have thermal bridging in the seams right there. So this construction, it's similar to a boat, right? They're going to look, they have these molds that they've built and they lay out the fiberglass inside the mold and then they break it out and you have a one piece shell. It's essentially a boat. You could flip it upside down. Now there are a few little points of entry like where you install the AC. Obviously that would require maintenance, but 80% of the trailer is completely seamless. And you can see this all the way around the edges, around the corners. You have some cabinetry in here um, with the exception of some of the cabinetry. It's a zero wood material build. So the floors, this is a, it's like a space composite material that they use in NASA. And this, this material is super light, but also zero wood. It will float, right? So they, they always joke about how it's pretty much a boat. You could throw it in the, throw it in the lake and it would float away. And, and this is really important when it comes to just owning a trailer and longevity and the durability of it. You're not going to be dealing, certainly not going to be dealing with warranty issues when it comes to leaky seams or having to reseal them every year. So that's one of my favorite things. But as you can see, there are a lot of different options and these guys have just done some really cool little touches. You can see these handles right here, how they carve that out to actually make a, a grab, a handle right there. Anyway, you have everything you need to get off grid and to have a good time camping in the outback. Tons and tons of clearance on these things. And you have outdoor showers, 
you have the onboard water. One of the cool things too uh, that I really like is they are, they have some options for suspension. Uh, the three main options, they have a uh, just a standard, uh, like a solid axle, which is gonna be more heavy duty for uh, obviously a toy hauler version. They also have the independent uh, suspension and the independent can come in a timber and independent or it can actually come in an air bag uh, with gas shock suspension. So you have a few different options and these guys are, they're pretty good at optioning some things out. As you can see, they're using the uh, true 12 volt Dometic AC unit. The cabin's not super big, so it works really well for a trailer this size. Let me show you the inside. As you can see, you come on inside and it's very spacious. This is a large cabin, really roomy in here. And I, I think one of the biggest reasons is because of that molded fiberglass shell, right? That one piece composite that just allows a lot more space. Cause a lot of trailers that you're gonna see that are built like this, they're gonna have walls, right? They're gonna have aluminum studs. They're gonna have inside outside studs. This is gonna be very, very good to eliminate hot and cold transfer. And then also it just gives you a lot more space overall. This is a queen size bed. But there you have it. Today is not a full in-depth tour. That was not my intention. I just wanted to introduce the new product line that we're carrying here at ROA Off-Road. And you'll be able to get one of these units at our South Carolina location or at our Utah Experience Center here. Um, we have these right now on the ground for you to come and check out. But we're gonna be taking these out and doing what we do best, test them, put them through the strengths test, take them down to Moab and really beat the heck out of them and see how well they hold up. I suspect just from what I know with these guys and my experience with the other stuff that they're building with us, they're gonna do really, really well. And I'm really excited about carrying this new product line. So if you have any questions, feel free to text us at 801-860-0035. You can also call that number or reach out to us here. One of our sales coach coaches can help you and guide you and let you know if this is the right trailer for you. So thank you so much for watching and hopefully stay tuned, subscribe, because we're gonna be doing some full tours and going out on some crazy adventures with these things. So we'll stay tuned for that and we'll see you soon, bye-bye.